I remember when we first began, it, uh, it felt like this impossible, totally impossible dream. You know, we were just a small group of us with no money and no office and just this, this big idea to tackle one of the greatest challenges of our time. And, uh, you know, what's happened in the last month is a true miracle. We created a presentation on the end of extreme poverty, a roadmap and a vision for our generation. We delivered it all over Australia. It took off from Australia to New Zealand, to the UK, to the USA and Canada. We opened up offices. People began to bike across their country to share the story of the end of extreme poverty. They jumped in vans and toured. They threw crazy parties. They made activism fun. We did experiential campaigns and lived under $1.50 per day in food to raise money for the extreme poor. Celebrities began to reach out. Academics blogged, we did photo shoots, sold shirts, and created installations to point to the bigger picture. We began to sit down with powerful people, politicians, economists, rock stars, and our partners on the ground, to draw out plans for our next big move, to shake the dust on extreme poverty. As an organisation, we stand on the shoulder of giants. The Rotary International of this world and other organisations have closed the gap, but there's still more to do. So we sent out a clarion call to the end of polio. We launched a massive campaign with viral videos, door-to-door -door relationships and petitions that skyrocketed in numbers. We quantified the desire of our generation to end this disease. We dreamed and began to execute on a massive public awareness event during Chogham when world leaders were in Australia. We were thrown a concert in Perth around the end of polio and together with our partners it worked. Our generation was expressing themselves for this old issue in a completely new and exciting way. Today is a day to celebrate, as Global Poverty Project and much of the rest of the world celebrates the effort to end polio. Eradicating a disease that keeps people in extreme poverty is extreme progress, and it enters us into the best life dedicated for people. This is just the beginning. <laughs>